first man I've ever seen to have painted toenails <laughs> in the case of the lab history. Perhaps I've shared too much, I don't know. That's what happens when you have a four-year-old girl. <laughs> Daniel, I'm so proud of you. Um, very courageously, you stood before a body of believers and you see these folks here. They're not here to judge you or to criticize or to condemn. They're here to love you and support you and encourage you every step of the way. And together, we're entering into this partnership in which we want to hold each other accountable for the days that lie ahead. As a spiritual head of your household, you are setting a new standard. You are drawing a line in the sand and say, for this day forward, things will be different. Like we read in the scripture today, behold, he makes all things new. The old is gone. For this day forward, the old has passed away. Behold, all things are new. Amen? Amen. It's my pleasure and honor, Daniel to baptize you in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Him in baptism, please begin with the newness of life. As the spiritual head of your household, We've talked about the awesome privilege and responsibility that you have now in baptizing your lovely bride. And Daniel, this is a special and it is a powerful moment in your family. It is a tremendous honor for you to baptize Katie in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with him in baptism and raised again to the newness of